Hey everybody, this is Sister Sarah Brown with another episode of I Heart Street Art. I uh, am walking down uh, the Bowery in between Houston and Stanton and um, over here in the Lower East Side in Manhattan. And the thing is with street art, man, if you want to experience it, you got to be looking everywhere. You got to be looking up to the sky, you got to be looking from side to side, and you got to be looking down because I just came across a really beautiful piece of street art. Um, there's a little backstory to it uh, that I will share with you. And um, this is just such a lovely surprise. And it feels like um, there's a portal beneath my feet opening up into a creative universe that I so would love to dive into. And um, when I look at this, I just imagine what it would be like to be in such a spiritual, magical place. So I hope uh, you dig it as well, and I'm going to share it with you. All right, let's check it out. <laughs> All right, so this is what I'm talking about. This is a beautiful painted figure of a woman flying through space on the crack cement space. <laughs> what uh, what the story, backstory is, I was last week coming out of my apartment. I had had a really rough night um, grappling with some stuff with my heart and I came out and there was a truck sitting there right in front of my doorway and the whole side was painted just this big beautiful um it i don't know if you're familiar with alex gray's work but it's called transcendentalism and this figure was in the middle there was a huge heart right above her um of like an actual heart not the cutesy painted one um, but, you know, a very detailed painting of the heart. And all around her were these streams of sunlight bursting out. And then there was these little figures of all these different animals and people that very much like streaming through the universe and streaming through the heart and coming back out. It just was such, and the colors, I mean, like where you can see here, the yellow and the orange and the red that are just kabam. Um, the colors on the truck were equally vibrant and just totally um, overwhelming to the eye and beautiful with just this bright blues and green and the red red of the heart and then this figure um, you know flying through space was I believe yellow surrounded in orange and it was just so compelling to me um, and so kind of spoke the story of um, where I was at that morning, coming from just a really intense uh, evening of, um, you know, flying through space with my heart. So, um, that I find this figure here um, on the sidewalk uh, is just such a beautiful surprise because I didn't document that truck, which I call moving dreams when the trucks are, um, you know, covered in street art. They become moving dreams to me. And I've done I Heart Street Art segments on the ones in the city that I've seen so far that really, I think, are fantastic. But this one I did not. Um, I was a little emotionally raw. So to be able to see this figure again and to be able to document it for you now is an incredible honor and pleasure. And whoever this artist is, I just want to thank you because you have done some artwork that has sh shown a light into my, you know, vulnerable sore spaces and helped in the healing process and to just um, so very clearly depict an emotional state helps make me feel not alone in this human endeavor. So I thank you. <laughs> Sister Sarah Brown, thank you. So, uh, that's about it. Uh, have an absolutely righteous day. Like I said, I'm in the Lower East Side on the Bowery between Houston and Stanton. And who knows how long this beautiful little piece is going to be here. But um, if you're walking down the street, look everywhere. And perhaps you'll have that beautiful little mirror of what's going on inside your heart and mind. that will help you feel less alone in this world. Because we're all sharing the same groove train, actually. Um, no one's alone. So, peace out. Have an absolutely righteous day.